Today on the show, we're taking a look at the pop games, Mortal Kombat X, number 250, Scorpion Vinyl Figure. So stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Comic Gaiden TV where all geek culture collides. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. Alright guys, as I said, we're taking a look at the Pop Games Mortal Kombat X 250 Scorpion Vinyl Figure. Uh, I've got back on back here on my computer. Let's go ahead and turn this a minute so I can see what I'm reading. Uh, a little description, origin of Scorpion. Vengeance will be mine. Hanzo Hazashi, also known as Scorpion, is a resurrected ninja in the Mortal Kombat fighting game series. He is one of the very few original characters debuting in the first Mortal Kombat arcade game. He holds the distinction, along with Raiden and Sub-Zero, in one form or another, of appearing in every generation of Mortal Kombat games as a playable character. Uh, Scorpion has always been my favorite character. Uh, even before I started playing Mortal Kombat, just the look of him, just, it looked awesome. I did not like, though, uh, his look in the first Mortal Kombat movie. Uh, but in the later games, they really made him look amazing. I still have not yet played the later games, except for DC Universe vs. Mortal Kombat. That's the latest game of Mortal, on the Mortal Kombat series I've played. Because um, I'm not really into the fighting games anymore. But I will always have a special place in my heart for Scorpion. As you can see here on the display side, you got Scorpion in uh, what looks like Sha uh, Shao Kahn's uh, realm. And then on the back, you have number 250 is Scorpion, 251 is Sub Zero, uh, 252 is Liu Kang, 253 is Kitana. 254 is Raiden. Uh, Raiden, of course, was based upon uh, Thunder and Lightning of the Three Storms in the uh, Big Trouble in Little China movie. Uh, one that I really want to get next is going to be Sub-Zero. I always liked the look of the ninjas. Uh, Scorpion, Sub-Zero, Reptile, uh, Smoke when he debuted. Uh, I believe Smoke was a special character in... Uh, Mortal Kombat, I believe, 2. You had to punch in a special code or beat the game. Uh, punch in a special code after you beat the game or something like that in order to get him. Uh, but he would pop up every now and then in the background. Um, so I w I'd like them to make Reptile and Smoke too. With that being said, let's go ahead and take him out of the package. Uh, another one of the, another ninja that didn't really get a lo very much love, I believe, was Rain. There was a ninja called Rain, I believe. Uh, he had a purple outfit. Uh, Smoke had the gray outfit. Sub Zero the blue. Scorpion the yellow. Reptile the green. Um, I don't really know much about Rain though. Uh, I think he only made maybe a handful of appearances. Uh, but this guy looks really great. You got the dark circle around the eyes. His head does turn all the way around. It would have been nice though if they would have had his little uh, his little dagger coming out of his hand, getting ready to launch. Uh, that would have been nice. But his mask, it almost looks kind of like. Um, Kind of like a skull would. I mean, not with the teeth or anything, but just like this area here and here. It almost lo looks like kind of the uh, the teeth showing, the jaw, you know. That looks really nice. Uh, I really like his design here. Uh, it looks very mystic, very ancient. Very nice. Really like it. Really like Scorpion. Really hope they do the other ninjas from the series. I'm definitely going to have to pick up uh, Sub-Zero. Um, originally I thought about waiting and putting uh, airing this during uh, the month of October. 
but I think I'm going to have something else planned for October. We've already uh, started filming the October reviews. So I think I'm going to do a little bit something a little bit different with the pops for the month of October. Uh, one of those pops is the Ash vs. the Evil Dead Ash Williams vinyl figure that we're going to be reviewing uh, the first Tuesday in October. So make sure and tune in for that. Uh, I haven't decided though if I want to do an Evil Dead pop review all through the month of October or not. Uh, there's plenty of pops to do. I'm not sure if I want to go that route or not though. Obviously last year for October we did uh, the Gremlins Stripe, we did Michael Myers, we did Ghostface, and we did Reagan from The Ex Exorcist. Um, which kind of made me almost want to want to do Scorpion um, as the pop one of the pop reviews for October since he's kind of a horror-esque character but ultimately I decided to go another route uh, we do, we are pretty um, pretty solid on schedules for uh, pops right now I'm not sure exactly when this one is gonna air uh, but I hope once it does air you guys enjoy it uh, you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future pop reviews I'm Shannon for come again TV take care <laughs>